Would you guys go to Mexico by yourself? Um, oh, by myself? Uh, why not? Ball fire hit me hard. I came back alive. You went by yourself? Yeah, I went to uh, Mazatlan. Yeah. It's above Puerto Vallarta and uh, Morelia by myself. Came back alive. I mean, you know, for a woman, I think it's... I was going to say, you're also a man. Yeah, it's hard. But, uh, you know, for you guys, I don't think that's a big problem. Because I didn't speak any Espanol. Mm -hmm. I basically learned to survive. You just went over there without speaking at all? Yeah, no. That's so I interesting. I just had my iPhone, and there's a free translation app in the iPhone. Mm -hmm. I say it, and I say, uh, hey, how much is this one? It's going to translate to Espanol. <laughs> you know, yeah, press the button. Yeah. Give you that tourist price. Yeah. Especially, that's especially <laughs> I, that I know, but price. have you like ever heard about Mazatlan? Nope. Because there's uh, when I went there, it was in um, December to early January. Like I was the only tourist. Oh. Yeah, I was the only tourist. Everyone is uh, like pure Mexican. No one speaks English at all. Mm -hmm. And I think I don't know. I just had fun because um, you know solo adventure. I think it's pretty worth of experience i would say yeah yeah it's definitely a good way to find yourself mm -hmm. definitely that's how i get this tattoo where I, like it's everything is under 200 dollars. really yeah oh. and i told my parents well i didn't tell them they somehow find it out yeah. and my parents are really classic korean parents they are so angry like they say you should never get a tattoo again they only know about this tattoo you don't know about this one and this one, <laughs> so no, they, uh, it's okay. I mean, even uh, even though they, I meet them in person to person, what, what should I do about it? Nothing. Long sleeves, huh? Long sleeves. Well, I mean, also it's something permanent. It's not like you're gonna be able to change it. Yeah. So I mean, you're just gonna have to live with it. It's a decision you made. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, look at my tattoo. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> also, I think uh, I did this tattoo for not to show off, but I think as a meaning to me. Because I get this, this one, I love Harry Potter, and the Slytherin people, they have the, the Death Eaters, have this tattoo. I like that. Mm -hmm. I got the, this one, because I want to visit all the countries, all the nations around the world. Mm -hmm. And Carpe Diem was from my, uh, one of my favorite movies called uh, The Dead Poet Society. Have you guys ever seen that? What is I've it? heard of it. Dead Poet Society. Robin Williams was in the movie. I think that was my first time I cried in the entire life. And he says about Carpe Diem, like, live the moment. Like, that just struck me, so I got this tattoo. Seize the day. Yeah, seize the day. Yeah. Would you guys uh, get a tattoo? Probably or would you guys not. already have a tattoo? I do not have any you don't? tattoos. I wouldn't get one. <laughs> you wouldn't? No. Why not? Um, my mom wouldn't let me, so. Okay. <laughs> okay. I just think it's, um, I just don't like needles. Like, mm. it's scary. I thought it's the same thing, too. It's, like, gross. Yeah. Like, before I went to Mexico and a few years before I went to Mexico and get a tattoo, I was thinking, like, why people get a tattoo? I, I don't see the purpose. But when I actually go there and then, I don't know, I think solo travel kind of, you know, taught me free life, I, I would say. Yeah. And about the needle, it is painful at first, but you somehow get to enjoy the pain. Interesting. It is interesting because I don't like the pain at first, mm -hmm. but once you, you know, like, let's say 30 minutes later, you somehow endure the pain and you just, you know, go to sleep because you will get so bored of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. Just a, just a tip. Would you get a tattoo? I almost got one when I was in Spain, actually. Okay. Did you actually? No, because I was committed to play at an academy. Okay. And when you go to the academy, you have to record all of your tattoos, and it just felt like a pain to have to be like, Sir, so I have this tattoo, oh, wow. and like explain it. So I just didn't do it. Do, so when you have a uh, tattoo and go to uh, academy, do you have to erase them? Or... No, no, you can have them. Oh, you just okay. have to go through like a reporting process. I was okay. just too lazy to do that.